Hi everybody, my name is Oliver. Thank you so much for joining me for today's fitness class. I've got an awesome class prepared for you. All we're gonna need is some kind of elevated surface, a step, you can use the couch, a chair, um, but try to keep it a little, maybe about a foot off the ground, nothing too high. You're gonna need a mat or a towel, set of dumbbells, and most important, some water. Alrighty, so let's start with a nice light march. Get that heart rate elevated. We'll explain what we're gonna do today. I've got four sets set up for you. Each set is gonna consist of three to four exercises. After we complete each set two times, our goal today, I'm gonna sneak it in there this week, 60 decline push-ups to target the lower, um, the lower chest muscle fibers. Alrighty, a few weeks back we did flat. Last week, if I recall, we did plyo squats. This week, we did decline chest. Get those knees up. So remember, this is your class. If you need a break, just press pause, take a break, and join in. But try your best to keep up with the pace. Already, step touch to the right. Step touch. Get those arms going. Nice and easy. Get the blood flow right through the deltoids and the shoulders. Keep your chest up nice and proud. Nice and easy. Here we go. In four, three, two, heel, dig in front. Dig, like you're doing a row now. Open that chest every time you pull. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. We're prepping those muscles for the class without resistance right now. Keep it up. Very good. Give me four, three, two, leg curls. That's warm up those hamstrings. Again, pull it right in. Pull, pull, pull. There you go. Very good. Here we go. In four, three, to the front, knees up to the side, like you're breaking a two by four right over the knee. There you go. Engaging those hip flexors, the obliques, shoulders, full body warm up, baby. Keep it going. Here we go. Four, three, two, back to you start. Step, touch, touch. Again with those side raises for the shoulders. Very good. Keep it up. Excellent. Here we go. For four, three, two, heel dig in front. Dig. Squeeze that back. Open up that chest. Drop those shoulders back and down. Excellent. Here we go. Give me four, three, two, leg curl. Come on. Curl. Curl. Good. Here we go. For four, three, two, to the front. Come on. Knees, 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 knees. Nice and easy. Very good. Here we go. Last time for four, three, two, and shake it out. Good. You're going to take that right leg forward, left foot back. Light on the balls of your feet. Take your hands up. You're going to give me a right jab to the screen. Jab, 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 jab. This one back here is waiting. Let me show the profile. Jab, jab. Here we go for eight, seven, six. Bring it right back to your chin. Three, two, from the back. Here we go. Eight, seven, twist from the hips. Five, four, three, two, together. Come on. Eight, switch. Seven, switch. Five, come on. Four more. Three, Two, one, skip it out. Woo, now we're talking. Change that foot position, left leg forward, right foot back. Left hand forward, practice with that jab. Jab, back to your chin, to your chin. Elbow back to the ribs. Four, let's go. Eight, seven, six. Get ready for this hand in the back. Four, three, two, from the back. Eight, seven, six, twist at the hips, five, Four, three, two, together. Eight, five, come on. Four, three, two, and one. Skip it out. Excellent work, friends. March it out, y'all, march it out. Very good. Shoulders, roll them back. Roll them back. Three more. Two, and one. End with your shoulders back and down. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Feel the stretch go from shoulder to shoulder, right through the chest. Very good, hold it there. Shake it out. Interlock your fingers. 
Round the shoulders forward. Very good. Shake it out, friends. Get that left leg directly in front of your knee and hip. Put all your weights on your right thigh. Right there. Excellent. Hold it there. One of the better and more safer stretches for those hamstrings, as I always say. Keep it right there. Whew. Shake it out. Get that ankle right to your touch thighs together. Drive those hips forward. All right. Now let's switch sides. All ready? All the weight on that thigh. Feel it right underneath the quad. So right into the hamstring. Lock that knee. Pull that toe up and hold. Shake it out. Good. Let's stretch out those quads before we get started. Again, thighs together. Then you drive those hips forward. Thighs together. And then drive those hips forward. Very good, friends. Keep it up. Keep it up. Whew. All right, grab your water. I'm going to demonstrate our first four. It's really three moves, but the fourth move is going to combine them all. So grab your weights and get ready for this one. Again, like I said, this is your class. Take breaks as long as you need, but try, try, try your best. All y'all, try your best to stick with the tempo, okay? So each exercise we're going to perform is going to be for 30 seconds each. So check it out. First one, we're going with a wide stance, and you'll find out why later. So wider than shoulders, shoulders, angle those toes out. Slight bend at your elbows, palms facing me. From here, 30 seconds around the world. Alrighty. Then you're gonna let your arms hang in the middle. 30 second wide squat. Pretty simple. Then we're gonna come a little bit lower, and from here, alternate biceps curl, okay? With a supinated grip here. 30 seconds. Then our last set is gonna combine everything. So starting here, around the world, bring it down. One, two, again. Okay? We'll smash out a couple there for 30 seconds. So that's four moves. I'll give you a 15 second break before we do them again. Ready? Around the world, show me those palms. Let's go. Up, 30 seconds, guys. Nice and easy. Let me show that profile. So those weights are always in front of the body, but close. Slight bend at the elbows. Right there, nice and slow. You don't want to go too heavy with this weight, nor do you want to go too light. Keep it up. 10 seconds to go, and we get into those wide squats. And you got this. For four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Palms face each other, squat it out. Nice and easy. Chest proud throughout the whole movement. Don't fully lock out those legs on the way up. Keep it right there. Come on. Halfway there. 15 seconds, friends. Let's go, y'all. Stay with me. Come on. Here we go. For five, four, three, two, one. Stay low and alternate that bicep curl. Bring it in. Let me show that side view. Right here. Elbows are directly below the shoulders at all times, just hanging there, isolating that bicep. As you can see, my, my elbows do not swing, and neither should yours. Keep them right there. Halfway there, 15 seconds, friends. Then we combine it all together. Come on, pump it out. For five, four, three, two, and one. Stand tall, show me those palms. 45 seconds, 30 seconds, sorry. All together. Squat low, give me two. Again. Around the world, squat back low, give me two. Again. Around the world, you got it, baby. Let's go. Piece of cake, right? Nice and easy, friends. Come on. Halfway there. Nice and controlled. You got a 15 second break. Boxing shuffle coming up. In four, three, finish it off. Two and one. 15 second break on the balls of your feet. Shake those arms out. Look at my heels. Almost twisting at the hip here, so your heels come forward. Taking turns. 10 seconds, and we'll go for round two. So this is more of an active recovery. If this is too much, just march it out. Just keep moving. I want the heart rate elevated. You work so hard in that warm up and in that first set to get it up. Let's keep it up. All ready? Great time over, friends. 
Grab those weights. Ready? Together. Let's go. Bring it up, down, around the world, baby. Come on. Nice and easy. Slow and steady wins the race. Let's go. We're halfway there. 15 seconds to go. Come on. Exhale as you lift. Here we go for five, four, come on, three, two, and one. Wide squat, palms face each other. 30 seconds, nice and easy. Very good. Come on, 15 seconds. And we got those bent over bicep curls, isolated bicep curls. Come on. Stay with me here, y'all. You got this. For five, four, three. Take that chest up and low. Here we go. 30 second. Alternating bicep curl. That's supinated grips. That's palms facing up at the end of your move motion. The movement here. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Feel that beat. Chase it down. Halfway there. 15 seconds. Cause let's go. Come on. Here we go for five, four. Get ready to combine it all together. Two and one. Show me those palms. Let's go. Around the world. Squat it down. One and two. Again. 30 seconds. All I'm asking, friends. Come on. Palms face me on the way up and down. Halfway there, baby. 30, 15 seconds. Come on. You got this, y'all. In four, three, two, and one. Excellent. 15 seconds. This is your break. So remember, we got 15 push-ups coming on the incline. Because we're on an incline surface, it's literally mimicking the opposite, a decline chest press. So target, you're still hitting the chest. We're targeting more of the lower muscle fibers, okay? That lower part of your chest. So our goal is 60. 60 of those push-ups. We're gonna sneak them in there, shake them up, get ready. And by the end of the class, we would have done 60. So 15, okay? Let me show you two ways to do this. Obviously, hands are up, just a little bit outside of your shoulders. Watch my hips, drive them forward, and from here, you're gonna give me 15. Okay, if that's, if you can, try to bring it up right up onto your toes for 15. Ready, together, let's go. One, two, three, you got it. Four, five, 10 more, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Drop those hips back, stretch it out. Very good, round one done. We got three more to go, friends. Grab your water if you need it. I'll demonstrate the next three. For this one, yes, it's only three. So grab your dumbbells, have a look first. First move's a combo. Alrighty, feet are hip width apart, so a little bit more narrow. Hip width apart, hinge from your hip. From here, you're gonna give me a row, bring it down, and a straight pullback, okay? So again, a row, down, lock the arms, step bend the elbow, pull it back. Just so your arms are almost parallel to the ground. Okay, that's your combo. Then we're gonna stand up tall, 30 seconds of curtsy lunges, that's behind, really targeting those glutes, as well as the quads and hamstrings, okay? Key here, keep your eyes up, chest proud, abs taut. Last move, another combo. Two ways to do this, if you don't wanna do the combo, Give me two to the front, two to the side, or try the combo. Really good for the core, as well as for your coordination, okay? 30, 30, 30, 50 second break. We do it again, baby. Here we go in four, three, two, one. Let's go. Row, straight arm kickback. Row, 
straight arm kickback. Come on, 30 seconds, let's get it. Short class, but we gotta get the intensity up to make it worth our while. Come on. Come on, friends, halfway there, 15 seconds, you got this. Come on. Giving upper body a break in four, three, two, and one. Curtsy lunge, 30 seconds, let's go. Come on, bring that leg right behind. If this is too much for you, just give me that reverse lunge, I'll take it. But don't be shy, step outside your comfort zone. 15 seconds left, come on, you got this. Upper body combo coming on up. Come on, friends. Keep pushing for five, four, three, two, and one. Ready for that combo? Let's go. One to the front, one to the side. 30 seconds, come on. Just to shoulder height, always have a slight bend in your elbow whether you're going to the front or the side. Option is here. To the front, two to the side. Again, you never go above the shoulder. A half rep. It's going better than going above the shoulder. Keep that in mind. Come on. Last 15 here. Here we go for 10, eight, six, four, three, two, one. Excellent friends. 15 second shuffle right here. Shake those arms out. Almost feel that burn, leave. That elastic acid, leave. 10 seconds, going for round two. Starting with the posterior chain, hitting that back. Alrighty friends, grab your dumbbells. In four, three, two, one. Let's go. Row, straight arm kick back. Row, kick back, row kick back squeeze that upper back come on you want to work on that posture here's a great way come on I want you to be a nice sweaty mess by the end of this come on Jada let's go <laughs> let's throw friends come on let's go Woo! good job curtsy line 30 seconds come on ooh wee Jonathan, come on, let's go! Halfway there already, all 15 seconds, come on. You got this. Side and front raise combo, coming on up. Testing that coordination. Come on. Here we go, baby, here we go. 15 seconds. Ten seconds. Here we go for four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Front and side raise in three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Let's get it. Feel that burn in those shoulders. Don't quit. Chase it down. This is why you're here. To feel uncomfortable. If you're getting annoyed with me. You're on the right page right now. You should be sick of me right now. This is good. Push yourself to your limit and then some. Come on. 10 seconds. Don't quit. For four, three, two, one. Break. 15 second shuffle before we hit the mat for those push ups, those dreaded push ups. Trust you, right now, I might, might not feel the greatest. I'm sure there's tons of better things to do. But by the time we're done this workout in this class, you're gonna feel amazing. Trust me. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Choose your position. Level one on your knees, level two on your toes, hands just outside the shoulders. In four, three, two, 15 push ups. Let's go. Nice and controlled. One, two, three. 
four elbows should be on a 45 degree angle away from the body let's go 10 9 8 7 6 more 5 4 3 come on friends 2 and 1 good job drop your knees push it back stretch the back and the shoulders with this one here Especially with the elevated surface, you get a better range of motion. Excellent, friends. Grab that water. Got some more combos coming for y'all. It's going to be great. You got lots of time. Have your water. Just have a look here. So what we're going to do is get into that deadlift. We're doing a deadlift squat combo for the first 30 seconds. So it looks like this. Let me show you the side. So deadlift, slight bend your knees. All the hinges coming from the hips. Come as low as you can. Whatever your flexibility is, that's fine. As you come up, pull your dumbbells up, squat. Bring it down, deadlift. And we go slow with this. Whether you get three, four, five, ten, slow and steady. 30 seconds here. Next move, take your dumbbells into a wide squat. 45 degree angle from the knee to the hip. And from here, alternate this narrow press. And we're not done with that. 30 seconds. Last move, you're gonna drop one dumbbell. Hold it right at your chest. 30 second jumping jacks right there while you hold that up. That does two things. Keeps the core contracted and the upper back and arms engaged as well. 30 seconds of each one. And then instead of our 15 second shuffle, you're gonna come against the wall if you can or if you can do it standing. 15 seconds worth of calf raises is gonna be your break before we repeat to the second set. Already? No one can ever say you skip leg day again. We sneak it in there. Already deadlift and squat in four, three, two. Let's go. Deadlift, squat with the dumbbells high. Deadlift, good. Deadlift, good. You got it, friends. Good. Come on. 15 seconds, friends. Come on. You got this. Ooh wee. Come on. Very good. Five, four, three, two. One more for good luck. Very good. Feet wide in the shoulders. Slight bend right here. Let's go. Pulse it up. One, two, one, two. 30 seconds. Pretty easy right now, especially if you're using lighter weights, but it will build up. That lactic acid will build up. Come on. 20 seconds. You got it. Chase it down, baby. Feel that sweat trickling down the face. That's what you want. Come on. Halfway there. Here we go for 10. 8. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. And 1. Woo! Drop that dumbbell. Bring it right by your chest. Elbows under the, the wrist. 30 second jacks, let's go. Out, in, out, in, to the beat, to the beat. Come on. On the balls of your feet, nice and easy. Here's your option. If you got knee issues, hip issues, back, keep moving. This is your option. Come on. 15 seconds. Don't worry, you get a break before we do it all over again, I promise. Kind of. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, 4 more. 3, two and one Woo! get against the wall if you have to if you don't need to balance anything to help balance go right into those calf raises ready 15 seconds let's go up down. on the way down pull those toes up okay let me get this way come on guys 10 seconds to go this is your break come on let's get it for four Three, two, and one. Woo! Shake it out. Grab those dumbbells. Break time's over. Ready? In four, three, deadlift and squat. Feet hip width apart. Let's go. Come on, friends. Let's go. Quality over quantity. I'll take three proper ones over 30 sloppy ones. 
All ready? Woo! We don't want no sloppy here. Perfection, baby. Come on. Last 10 seconds. Let's get it. We go right into those shoulder presses. In three, two, and one. Give me that wide stance. 45 degree from the knee to the hips. Palms face each other. Elbows under the wrists. Let's go. 30 seconds. Press. Press. Come on. Press. Press. Let's get it. Chest proud, eyes forward. Come on. 15, come on. For five, four, three, two, and one. Drop that dumbbell. Jumping jacks. Hold it tight. Let's go. 30 seconds. Out, in, out, in. Come on. Calf raise is coming on up. Come on. 15 seconds, halfway there. Come on. Here we go for five, four, three, two, and one. Calf raise, ready? 15 seconds, let's go. Up, pull the heels, or sorry, your toes to your shins. Hold time. Those knees should be locked. Nice straight line, hips up to the hips. Sorry, ankles to your hips. That made no sense, my bad. Come on. Woo! For five, three, two, and one. Very good. Grab your water. Hitting that mat. Round three of decline push-ups. Decline, again. When I say bring your elbows close to your ribs, I don't mean like right here but about there, okay? As you can see, my hands are below the shoulders. You're not winged out up here. Once you do this, you put yourself at risk for shoulder impingement. It's a very painful thing. I've had it multiple times, so that's what I know from experience. Bring your elbows down. You may not be able to do as many, but it's much more effective, much more safer, and this is what's gonna help you get more stronger. All ready? All right, pain, the pain you feel right now, the suffering we're going through, the suffering will all be replaced tomorrow with strength. Okay, trust a little bit of soreness, but strength will be stronger. So keep that in mind. We're going for 15. Level one here. Level two up here. Let's go together. Down, up. Two, three, five. Come on, push yourself. Ten, nine, eight. Chase it down. Seven. Let's go. Let's go. Four more. Three, two, one. Yes. Stretch it out, sorry, stretch it out. Keep your hands on that elevated surface. Again, you can use phone, well, we don't have phone books nowadays. Uh, you can use textbooks, stacks of magazines, the couch, take off those cushions so it's a little bit lower, a chair, or even your step, a step on the stairs for step. Hope you're feeling okay. One more step before we hit the mat with that core. So you're gonna grab both dumbbells. We're going against the wall or a pillar, whatever you got. So first thing, no weight. So keep them handy. Have a look here. You want to get to about as close to 90 as you can without hurting yourself. Set it to 90. Take your hands on top. My good friend, DJ Daniel, show me this one. You're just going to pulse right here. 30 seconds. It looks easy. I thought it was easy until I tried it, and it's really not. It burns. It burns like a bad perm. Okay, I'm just saying. After that 30 seconds, you're going to grab your dumbbells. Come up a little bit higher with your... With your tush in contact with the wall still. You're gonna keep that chest proud, hinge forward, let those arms hang, and you're gonna give me a rear delt fly for the upper back. Trust me, I know we did a lot of upper back, but we need that, especially in our society today. Once we finish that, drop the weights again, 30 seconds, split punch. So look like this. That's it, 30 seconds. And then, as you break, 15 second calf raises. A lot of stuff coming your way, I know. So I'm going to do it with you, as always. No weights for the first one. Everybody down for 30 seconds. Let's go. Pulse. The Daniel special right here. Come on, peanut plaza, baby. Patting a cocoa bun. Let's work for it. Let's go. No, I'm, that's next week. Woo! Wow, these look a lot easier than, than they are. So make sure your lower back and upper back are against the wall. Those quads should be firing off. 
You're 15 seconds away from stopping this. So come on. Stay with me. Ooh wee. Here we go for five, four, three, two, one. Very good. Shake it out. Your heels are going to come a little bit closer to the wall now. Bend at the knees. Pinch from your hip. This helps at the end of the class, especially when that lower back is fatiguing. I don't want you to injure yourself when trying to push it to your limits. So this will help you push it to your limits safely. Ready? 30 seconds. Let's go. Fly. Fly. Slide bend at the elbows. Come on. Squeeze that upper back as you bring it back. Come on. Push it. Come on, friends. Let's get it, yo. Let's get it. 10 seconds. Eight. Six. Four. Two. And one. Woo. 30 second split punch. One leg forward. Off to the hand forward. Off to the hand at your, sh at your shin. Let's go. One, two. One, two. 30 seconds. Come on. Sorry, let me get back on screen. Come on. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on, J&J. Let's go. Push it. For five, four, three, two, one. Woo. Calf raises. 15. Let's go. Up. Two, three, four. Five. Come on, pull those toes right to your shins. Eight. Here we go. Last five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Woo! Excellent job, friends. That was your break. Get against the wall. One more set, baby. If you want to quit, you're on the right track. Squat it down. Hands out. 30 seconds. Let's go. So last set, friends. Then we got a couple push-ups, you know, the usual. Then some core, and we're done, son. Keep it up, friends. Come on. Woo! This one should really burn. 15 seconds to go, halfway. <sighs> wow. This is a good one. This one we will definitely feel tomorrow. Like I said, suffer. Feel that pain today, only for it to be replaced by strength tomorrow. Good. Shake it out. Grab those dumbbells, heels closer to the wall, bend your knees, hinge forward from the hip. Let's fly it out. Come on, friends. Ah, halfway there, 15 seconds. Ah, come on, squeeze, squeeze. For four, three, two, and one. Woo! Split punch. 30 seconds. Ready, steady, let's go. Come on. Come on, friends. Get that sweat going. We're almost done this class. With me right to the end. With me to the end. 15 seconds. Keep those hands up. I know your body wants to drop those arms. Fight it. Come on. For five, four, three, two, one. Woo. Calf raise time for 15. Then we get our last set of push-ups. Ready, steady, lock the knees. Let's go. Up, curl it in. Up, bring it in. Come on. Got this, y'all. Come on. Ten seconds. Come on. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Shake that out, friends. If you have to, you drop to your knees for this last set. But if you can give me even two, three, four on your toes, I'll take it. Finish the rest on your knees. Aim high, as always, with everything in life. Aim high. Ready, friends? Last set. 
Let's get that 60 in four, three, choose your level. Let's go. Exhale as you come up. Three, slow, five. Come on, give me 10 more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four more. Come on, three, two, and one. Good work, guys. That's 60 reps. Now the fun part begins, right? Hitting that core. Get ready. Hitting that core. I won't keep you too much longer. I promise, y'all. I promise. All ready. Just going to need your body weight today. Starting on your back. Simple stuff, kind of. So for today, you're going to get both biceps right by your ears. Okay, sorry. Let me get rid of this hat. Biceps by your ears. Palm over palm. You're going to give me 10 crunches right here. And a proper crunch, friends, is two to three inches off the mat. We're not doing a sit-up. We're doing a crunch. Two to three inches. That's all you need. So right here, we're going for 10 with the biceps. That's the hardest way. Then we're doing 10 with your fingertips behind the head, supporting that noggin. 10 right here. And then the easiest way, across the chest. 10 right here. Three sets. As soon as you finish that, drop your hands on the mat. Drive the hips up. And we're just simply holding here for 20 seconds. Working the glutes, hip flexors, your transverse abdominis, your core, everything. Just by holding here and recovering. Because we're doing this two times. Ready? Don't quit on me now. You made it this far. Press pause if you got to. But you finish this workout with me. Ready? Together. Let's go. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. Three more, two, and fingertips, 10, Woo. nine, come on, eight, seven, make it to the end with me, come on, five, four, three, two, one, cross it up, 10, two, eight, seven, six, come on, five, four, three, two, and one. Rest your head, hands down, drive the hips up, squeeze your chest, squeeze those glutes, and hold for 20 seconds, right here. Nice and high, friends. Squeeze your tush. Keep those abs taut, contracted, but not flexed. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, bring it down. Excellent. Biceps by the ears again. You got this. Ready? 30 crunches. All three levels. Let's go. 10. 9. Look at the ceiling. Focus on one point. It helps. 6. 4. 3. 2. Fingertips, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, cross it up last time, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five. Come on. Four. Three. Two. One. Woo! Drive those hips up and hold. 20 seconds. Piece of cake compared to those crunches, right? Very good. Keep those abs taut. Abs taut. Very good for four, three, two, and one. Bring it down, pull the knees in, grab under the knees, rock your body side to side. Great job. We're gonna hit up those obliques next. Drop your feet, take one foot on top of the other knee, take the opposite arm behind the head, the hand behind the head, sorry, and we're just gonna crunch 
right here, 15 reps. All right, then we'll switch sides. Two sets per side. Ready, steady, let's go. Up, down, two, three, four, five. Come on, 10 more. Nine, eight, seven, six. All good, all good. Five, four, three, two, and switch sides. Ready? Steady. Let's go. Up. Two. Come on, friends. Five. Let's go. Ten more. Five more. Four. Three. Two. And one. You know what, guys? As a break, let's get those hips up like we did the first time. Might as well. 20 seconds. That ain't never kill nobody. Then we'll go one more set, side to side. With those oblique crunches. Very good. Keep that breathing continuous. Even. Controlled. Very good. Here we go in five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down slow. Bring that leg back up onto that knee in four, three, two, crunch it out. Here we go, 10, nine, eight, Six, five, four more, three, two, switch, ready, steady, let's go, up, two, three, here we go, give me ten more, nine, you got it, eight, six, Four, three, two, and one. Get me into that bridge. Get that bridge. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Keep those glutes tight. Abs taut. I'm on focus. Try to keep those hips up. Here we go for five. Four, three, Two, one, bring it down, excellent. Hands under the knees, rock your body side to side, y'all. Very good. One more move of the day, and we are done. We're getting to that bear pose. This is great for the full core, front and back. So all we're gonna do against that four point position, hands under the shoulders, okay? Knees under the hips, and you're on your balls of your feet. So from here, we're just gonna lift the knees off the mat, while maintaining a flat back, just a few inches off the mat, and we hold it there for 10. We'll bring it down for five, back up for 10, three sets, and we're done. All ready? Ready, steady. Everybody up, don't move. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two, and drop it for five, four, three, two, up. For 10, 8, 7, 6, come on, 5, 4, 3, 2, drop it down for 5, one more time friends, 3, 2, 1, let's go, up, here we go for 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, spread your knees to the edge of your mat, Drop the hips back. Hold it there, guys. And we're going to cool it down. Can you just stop? Can you try that one? Yeah, press it. That's okay. Alrighty, we are going to cool down to... Oh, wait. DJ Daniels. Um, 
That's good. This is better than nothing. That's okay. Oh, that's good. We'll go nice and relaxed today. Okay, friends. So I'm flat on your back. Listen to your breath because there is nothing else to listen to. So focus. Deep breath in through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. That's it. Deep breath in. Exhale. Continue with this breathing on your own. Focusing on that breath. Allowing that heart rate to drop and drop and drop. Same with that body temperature. Allow your body to cool down as we relax here in our puddles of sweat. Our well-deserved puddles here. Very good. Once more together as a group. Deep breath in. And exhale. Very good. Slowly open up your eyes. Now let's pull those heels together. So they make contact with each other. Allow gravity to pull your knees apart. Feel that stretch in the groin area. And relax. Very good, very good. Pull those knees back in. Let's grab underneath your knees. Rock your body side to side. Side to side. Very good. And now front and back until you come right back, right up onto your tush, just like so. Very good. Now get both legs extended in front of your hips. Pull one foot in. Reach out. Grab hold of that toe. And we're stretching out that hamstring. Very good. Hold it there. A few more seconds. Good. Slowly come back up. Switch sides. Reach and hold. Very good. Now we're going to come right down onto the mat. Bring your chest to your mat. Hands below the shoulders, elbows by your rib cage. Together, take a deep breath in. Exhale and press it up into that cobra stretch. Feel that stretch right through the abdomen. You may not realize we're also stretching out the front of your spine here. It's excellent. Good. Slowly pull your hips up. Spread your knees to the edge of your mat. Get them nice and wide. Get your big toes together. And then drive those hips back and hold. And hold. Very good. Come back up, nice and tall. Get 90 degrees in the both legs. Tilt your hips up so you feel that stretch in front of your left hip if your right leg is forward. And switch sides. Very good. Again, tilt the hip up. Feel it right in front. Very good. Take your hand on top of your opposite thigh. Help yourself up slowly. We're almost done here, friends. Take your arm right behind your back. Put your head to your right shoulder. So left arm behind the back, head to the right shoulder. Switch sides. Very good. Chin right down to your chest. Again, you let gravity do that work for you. Good. Bring the head back up slowly. Great job. Last one, guys. Feet wide on the shoulders. Cross your arms to your chest. In one deep breath, we're going to go all the way down. Squat down. Stretch as high as you can at, the, at which point we will release at the top, okay? Together. Deep breath in. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Exhale. One more for good luck. Deep breath in. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Exhale. And give yourself a hand. Great job today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me yet again. Have plenty of water, some type of protein once you're done this. And I'll see you all next week. Take care.